Hey, beautiful people. Welcome to my channel in the Notero 1122. All right, so this is going to be for Libra. To apologize for getting your reading out so late, but Sister Girl has some personal readings to get done and also replenish my energy. All right, so let's see. What do we have going on for Libra? I hope you guys are doing good. All right, so this will not fit with everyone. This may not be your reading, sweetheart. And if it is not, please come back for other readings and for the signs in your chart. Make sure that you check out other readers as well, okay? And just keep in mind that I am only the messenger. All right, so let's see. And if you're interested in a personal reading, as this is not, this is for a collective. Um, look in the description box for the link to my website in the notero1122.com. If you've already booked with me through simplybookme.com, uh, the last date to book through that website is actually uh, the 30th of this month. All right, so let's see. Cards are telling me concentrate, woman, concentrate. All right, let's see. What messages do you have for Libra? Libra, you might have kind of be keeping to yourself at the moment. Probably focusing on your money or some type of change that's coming towards you. Someone here is going through a financial pinch here. Like I said, someone might be focusing on their money right now, not really socializing too much. Um, kind of keeping to yourself, keeping your nose down. Hmm. Okay, there may be an older person, an older woman here that is really close to your heart right about now and possibly on your mind lately. Right, so I do see an end to this financial situation, which is pretty cool. I like it. All right, so... <clears throat> All right, so on the bottom of the deck, you have the fan, romance, celebration, and party. All right, so, and you have the tortoise, slowly but surely getting ahead. All right, so this is cool. I like it. So it looks like even though you got a little bit of adversity going on, you're still, you know, kind of doing your thing. If not, this is telling you that you need to, okay? Um, you might want to get out and kind of woosah, have some, you know, some freedom time here, okay, so that you're not stressed and overwhelmed, or if you're feeling stressed and overwhelmed, maybe this is something that you need to do, all right, so slowly but surely, you're getting ahead, <clears throat> excuse me, you have the carrot here with an opportunity or windfall, the lobster with the financial pinch, you have the uh, bird flying, news is on the way, hmm. All right, and then also you have the peacock here. Beware of great pride. Okay, and you have a staff. You'll be taken care of in different times. 
The bull don't back down from our positions. Uh, show strength and fortitude. The bridge successfully overcoming a problem. Older woman dealings or relationship with an older woman. I'm kind of feeling that this might be someone's mother. Doesn't have to be. This could be someone who um, embodies that energy in your life. Okay, someone that you respect very well, very much, I should say. All right, so you have the coins. Money will be coming your way. And you have the axe. Forces are working against you. However, always keep in mind that no weapons formed against you shall prosper. Make sure that you keep your vibration high. Don't bring into this, um, um, how should I say, don't bow to negative energy, sweetheart, okay? But don't be prideful, too. Um, make sure that you remain humble and grateful for the things that are coming into your life, okay? All right, so let's see. Looks like you're getting through something right here. And like I said, it kind of looks like uh, there might be some financial issues that you're working through. So you might be working, working, working. And Source is telling you, okay, um, it's okay to work, but don't overstress yourself, you know, over things that are out of your control. Do what you can do and let me do the rest, okay? So there's that. All right, so you might have um, a special someone in your life here. If not, you know, it's time you go out and, like I said, celebrate. Do your thing, you know, but just don't overdo it. You might be meeting someone new if you're single. Yeah, see, there's some concerns here. Also, you have the false person on the bottom of the deck. Um, this, I don't get any, well, you do have something. You may have someone or something that's trying to interfere with what you have going on or stop you from achieving some type of goal, but they can't. What Source has for you, no man can take, all right, or they can't stop. What you can do is let that distraction, um, you know, kind of hinder your progress here, sweetheart, so just keep it pushing. There are some concerns here. Also, like I said, someone here may have some issues. I'm kind of thinking that it might be health issues or financial issues that this person here, this older woman, may not be telling you about. This person may not um, express everything that's going on with them. There may, they may be keeping some secrets about some health issues here or something like that, okay? And you might get some news about this. Let's see. And this doesn't have to be an older woman. This could just be someone who embodies the, um, wow. And this is on the bottom of the deck. It could be someone who is, uh, just carries feminine, feminine energy. Okay. Um, someone here who is very mature. All right. Let's see. I'm sorry, you guys. Uh, we have gnats here in Texas. We got every kind of bug that you can think of here in Texas. And, oh, my God, it's the season. So, yeah. All right. Anyway, I digress. All right. So, there might be a change in your residence here or there might be some travel here. Someone here might be actually traveling to go see uh, an, an older parent or something like that. You know, maybe one of their parents. And I was getting that because I actually saw the house here. And here you have mature woman. So there may be something going on with a family member that you uh, may need to check in on or you're going to go see about. Maybe you're getting some news about this person here, okay? Um, also, this may be someone that can actually help you out financially, but someone here is uh, maybe a little bit too prideful to ask or tell their their people, their family, uh, this person, what's going on with them, okay? And I, I get it, all right? But you got some type of blessing coming, too. And I do see the messages of concern. All right, so let's see here. Um, I don't think I'm going to do all the oracles for you because I don't want to be here forever. Let's see what I want to do for you. You 
Let me see if I'm able to. <clears throat> All right, so you have Passion Ignited. <laughs> passion Ignited. You also have Movement Choices and Decisions and Partnership and Alliances. Okay, so yes, I like it. Emotional withdrawal. Ooh, okay. When it comes to the forces working against you, like I said, don't let that um, get you all up in your head, making you feel some type of way. Like I said, no weapons formed against you shall prosper. Just stay prayed up. Um, stay in that manifestation energy because... The energy that you start dwelling in is what you start, um, you know, gravitating towards you, okay? So, make sure that you stay in high vibrations at all times. I cannot find the cards that I want to use. All right. Also, like I said, you know, you have romance and celebration. You may be uh, meeting someone new, may have met someone new. And maybe you need to just kind of, oh my God, I'm not going to say that, relax a little bit, okay? Um, so this is just telling you, you know, make sure that you're enjoying yourself in the face of adversity, okay? Don't um, pour all of your energy into work, 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 stress and obstacles and challenges and all this other stuff because that's life. You're always going to go through things, okay? So you got to enjoy the moments that you have in between, what's going on so that you keep yourself in balance here. All right. And I do see that there is going to be someone coming to not so much to your rescue, but um, to your aid by your side, you know, helping you work through a situation. Okay. And it's crazy because you got a cards one, two, and three. All right. So your steps are basically being ordered to me and just be patient. Everything is going to align up. And this could be definitely somebody new here. I'm not even using this deck with this Ace of Cups. It's like, hello, you see me sitting here staring at you? So, yeah, I just got to let you know that. Let's see. I want to use these. All right, so let's see. Thank you. Your hard work is paying off. Like I said, slow, um, slow and steady wins the race here so you may not see it coming to fruition but things are working behind the scenes okay sources got your back it's a time for healing here so i don't know what's going on with that you may have to heal some relationships here also there may be um some past heartache and pain or something that you're going through or experience that uh, you may need to take some time out to woosa and kind of you know heal your heart on this situation Okay. I don't know why, but I'm getting that someone here may be in conflict or there may be some conflict that arises possibly with siblings. Or something like this about this person here, but I'm going to leave that alone. All right, and it says, what do you need to release? Okay, what is it that you need to let go of? All right, meditate and contemplate. All right, so one I can see is like worry, stress, and anxiety. All right, and negative energy. All right, so let's get into the tarot and see what we got going on for Libra. All right, I was hoping this was going to be short, but... Y'all know I'm long-winded. Let's see. All right, so you have the Queen of Wands. I see that you work, 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 working. Yes. Gathering coins here. Going full force, too. All right. There also might be someone here that finds you very attractive. Or this could be you towards someone else. But 
I also see that you got this fire energy going on too, working after, working towards what it is that you want. Ace of Cups on the bottom of the deck. Someone is finding you very, very alluring. <laughs> So there is going to be some type of transformation in your funds here, your financial situation, okay? I do see that you're going to be making decisions on what it is that you want to do. Also, you may be relocating, traveling here for a new job here. So you may be ending a situation here to move on to something new or maybe considering it, okay? You might have an, an offer coming through to... Um, relocate and move to another job here but you definitely got something stable coming for you okay i see that you are trying to make a head over heart decision on moving on like i said i see some travel here sorry you guys This may be unexpected or abrupt, possibly because some news that you hear. I really don't like this message that I'm getting. Whoever this is for, this is surrounding an older person. I honestly think that they're, ooh, snap, yeah, see. I don't know who this is, but someone here is really thinking about something obsessively but kind of keeping it quiet not really telling anyone what you're thinking what your plan is your goals being very strategic on how you move how you work and then also this could definitely be about making a decision to relocate, to move, something that has to do with your family and home. And then also, I don't know why, but I'm getting, somebody has some siblings here that Doesn't have to be siblings, but it's something surrounding this older lady here. Someone is being very sneaky here. Being very sneaky. They're also doing shit behind the scenes. Excuse my expression, but don't because it is what it is. Somebody's trying to keep you from getting something. An inheritance or something like that. Or keep you away from this older person here not giving you the information that you need hold on because yeah give me one for this older woman what's going on here because this is bothering me okay there's certain people working together possibly three working together to keep you at bay. I just saw the nine of swords before I pull this. Somebody's trying to keep you away, keep you at bay, keep you bound.
Give me one more. Ten of Cups. This is definitely family with the devil here. There's something going on here. And you got a few people that are collaborating together. So someone forces are working against you. But like I said, no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Whatever is done in the dark, you will. It'll be illuminated for you, sweetheart. I almost don't want to even do this damn reading. What the hell? Give me one more. Use your intuition. Um, you possibly already know that this is going on, sweetheart. But what God has for you, no man can stop. What is this? What is, oh man, you got the nine of wands here. So there may be some harsh communication here that's going to kind of send you in your head for a minute. You might retreat. Not really say too much. This could be behind money. Like I said, maybe an inheritance or something like that. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to try to leave this alone, but I don't know why this is coming up. All right, so, anywho. That's weird. There may be some harsh communication coming in between. Ooh. But there's someone here that's in your life that's actually going to come in and help you with this. Okay, someone here might actually hear the words from a family member, a sibling or something like this that possibly lives um, near this older woman here. This person might actually come in and tell you, well, you know what? You haven't been here. You live far away. So who are you to come in and, you know, try to you know, run things or have any say so or whatever like that. Okay. So just be mindful of that energy. Also, I see that you are very concentrated on <laughs> what it is that you need to do, but there's some communication that's coming in here. That is, uh, it may hurt your feelings a little bit, sweetheart. And this might be unexpected. The wheel. Okay, I honestly see that there's going to be some changes in your work. There's a definite need to actually hold on to your pinnacles at this time, too. And hold your tongue. I'm telling you, somebody's trying to keep you stuck. And there's going to be some harsh communication coming through. Mm -mm. But don't you know God don't like ugly? And he ain't fond of our pretty. You got the seven of wands. Okay, so you're going to have to protect your energy, protect your space from certain things, from some unexpected news that's coming down. Give me one, Miss Devil. The Magician. Oh my God. You have the devil, the ten of cups, the devil, and the magician. What in the entire fuck? You really got somebody that is diligently working against you. Oh, what did I just say? Working against you. Who is this? They're trying to cut you out of something. Judging. 
judge and jury making decisions and this is definitely a family member oh my what is this somebody is trying to cut you out of your birthright they don't want you near this person for whatever reason give me give me three actually give me give me one with relevance on the bottom. Thank you. Okay. Evil eye, someone envies you to the point of them not wanting to see you succeed. All right. And you have the rainbow. Massive success is coming your way after you release someone toxic from your life. Absolutely. And return to center. Send that negative energy right on back. All right. And... What do you need to release? The devil, magician, and the devil. Damn, if this person is in the arts, you definitely got somebody that's doing black magic on your ass. This is not for everybody. Whoever this is, this person is like, or these people are seriously negative. It could be more than one. You might have people collaborating. Use your best judgment. They're trying to end something for you. And you know it. They're trying somebody's trying to cut someone out here. Let's see. Yeah, I see that you got the Four of Swords again. This is going to make you feel some type of way. Wounded warrior here. But, like I said, what God has for you, no man can take from you, sweetheart. Your blessings are on the way. It may take a minute. It may take a minute, all right? Um, just don't be all in your head, all in your emotions about this situation. Give me more about this Knight of Swords. What do you need to release nine of cups with the four of cups here? All right, so someone here may, um, they might make you an offer here. The hell? I don't know who this is for, but you need to stand your ground. All right, I didn't. I'm, I don't. I don't want to do this. I don't. I don't even want to post this shit. Oh my god! I have wasted like thirty minutes of my life on somebody else's bullshit. You need to release some negativity, and this is crazy because my cards are all. All right, well, fuck it. They're all mixed upside down and right side up. I'm going to take it. Oh, my God. It is. All right. Definitely need to let something go. Release negativity. The Hierophant. Some type of connection here that you have. It might be more than one person here, sweetheart. There's something you definitely got to let go of. Moving into calm waters. Focus on your connection, this love connection that you have, sweetheart. Put your efforts into that. And ask Source to figure this situation out with you. If this is your story, sweetheart, please know that you do have a new beginning coming in here, okay? Especially finances. Nine of Cups, Page of Wands. Be mindful of how you react to this situation as well. You know, take your time. Don't fly off the handle here, okay? Um, anyway, I do see that you are going to be financially abundant. You know, you're going to be cool. It might take a minute for things to come through. Um, yeah. Libra, I'm sorry. This is what I have for you. And I need to cleanse my space because this is like, wow, some negative ass energy. Okay. 